Alright nerds and casual scrollers, Apple's new A17 chip is here and it's so fast it makes my laptop look like a potato running Windows XP. Let's talk about what this chip is packing, why your iPhone's now a space shuttle, and if it's actually worth upgrading. So the A17 Pro, yeah they added Pro because apparently even chips need job titles now, is Apple's first chip built on the 3 nanometer process. Translation, it's smaller, faster, and more efficient. Basically like putting a jet engine in your iPhone. This chip has 6 CPU cores, 6 GPU cores, and 16 neural engine cores. Because clearly Apple thinks your phone should be better at math than you. Apple claims the CPU is 10% faster, the GPU is 20% faster, and the neural engine? It's crunching 35 trillion operations per second. That's more calculations than me trying to figure out what she meant when she said, do whatever you want. Gaming? Bro, this chip supports hardware-accelerated ray tracing, like console-level graphics, on your phone. We're talking Assassin's Creed Mirage on mobile in 2025. But here's the real question, should you care? If you're gaming, editing videos, or just flexing on Android users, then yeah, the A17 Pro is a beast. But if you're just using it for TikTok, texting, and forgetting to reply to group chats, you might not even notice the difference. So yeah, the A17 Pro is wild. It's got power, efficiency, and more cores than a farmer's market. Is it overkill? Maybe. Do we love it? Absolutely. Smash that like button if your phone is still rocking an A12 chip. Drop a comment if you're waiting for the iPhone 16 before selling your kidney. I'm out. Peace.